Defending Premier League champions Manchester City travel to a venue where winning hasn't come easily in recent times. City have only managed draws at Stokes Britannia Stadium in the past two campaigns, with last season's stalemate threatening to derail their title bid. However, Roberto Mancini's side are unbeaten so far in the league, and the manager is confident that can continue. Yeah, Stoke, I think that is uh, one of the worst pitch uh, in the Premier League because uh, it's very difficult. It's very difficult to play there because uh, they are a strong team. Uh, and uh, for us, it's very difficult. But not only for us, for all the, all the team. And, uh, but it's important that we, we try to play football like we, we do. City are boosted by the possible return of Argentina striker Sergio Aguero, who is back in training, having recovered from a knee injury. The 24-year-old is unlikely to start against Stoke, but could be fit for the UEFA Champions League clash with Real Madrid on Tuesday. Mario Balotelli could play after undergoing eye surgery, as could City's four new signings, but Mancini isn't certain. We, we decide because today is the first uh, training that we have together after the international break and uh, I want to wait uh, this training session and after I decide because we have a lot of players that arrive from the other side of the world. Meanwhile Stoke manager Tony Pulis welcomed former England striker Michael Owen to the club this week. After so few games in recent years it's unlikely the 32 year old is ready to start, something Pulis acknowledges. I think he had options um, elsewhere. Um, but we're very pleased to have got him. Now, what we've got to do is uh, get him as fit as we possibly can, as quick as we can, um, and hopefully, you know, he has a free run at trying to get in the team and stay in the team. From what the lad says, he's come back a lot fitter than what we thought he would. Um, he needs a lot more work with the ball and, and being in small-sided games and everything for his sharpness. But we're pleased. We're pleased the way he's come back. With or without Owen, Pulis will be hoping his team can maintain their strong home record against City tomorrow and pick up their first league win of the season.